and I love that example where it's, yeah, it shows breast cancer screening, jumping, you know, much more than five points. And let's let's talk about that for a second because if I'm a stars leader, I'm thinking, but we've got guardrails. Guardrails are you know coming into play for 2023 stars. They're they're gonna they're gonna keep this more predictable by themselves. They're gonna you know, they're going to keep all these cut points from shifting more than five points or 5%, um, you know, in 2024, right? That's the natural expectation. I think people, if they saw that slide for the tail of two measures, you're going to be like, yeah, but, you know, it's not going to go from 50 to 66 because that's more than 5%. But the reality is that it absolutely could do that. And that's because when the way CMS has got it structured, when they're prepping for the STARS 2024 cut points, we're getting ready to apply that guardrail. They're going to first run the Tukey analysis on the STARS 2023 cut points. So if we see kind of similar situations, you're going to see those big jumps and then the 5% is attached to that. So uh, I, I think the reality is it's the guardrails are applied, but I don't know that it's always going to feel like that. 